He was a 26-year-old um, charming boy. He was so beautiful. Alexandre Bijar was working as a waiter in London Bridge when the attack happened. His father will never forget that night. I tried to reach him by phone, SMS, messenger, everything. Didn't return the call. And I know that, that something really bad happened. But I was on, in front of the TV, so I see all the unfolding, the first rumor of a marauding attack, of a stabbing, and a French restaurant. And there I know that something really bad happened. This CCTV from inside Borough Bistro shows Alexandre reacting to the sound of the crash on the bridge. Outside, he came face to face with the attackers and was stabbed multiple times. He was alone, totally alone on this pavement for three minutes, you know. And all of that, uh, you know, I can't stand this idea, I can't live with. I, I try to come down, it's really hard. Alexandre was one of three French victims among the eight who died. Their attack was not sophisticated. It's a van and three knives. And they do so much bad. What happened to Alexandre is unacceptable. His father says the fact that Curran Butt was known to the authorities makes it worse. This attack was preventable. Do you believe that? Yes. The guy was really was known as dangerous for many years. He didn't hide his intention, it was public in front of police. What gives you the strength to go on? His brother and sister. And uh, the facts I have to do something for him. Just hours before the attack, Alexandre called his father to say he'd bought new sunglasses. These are the last images of his son enjoying his life before it was so cruelly snatched away. Leila Hayes, 5 News.